deals. Check out my website dealhunter.tech for the best tech deals with live price updates and new deals added every day. And good news, on top of the United States, we've added support for a bunch of countries including the UK and Canada. Link down below to go check it out. Welcome to Setup Hacks. This series is dedicated to finding cool products and tips to help improve your setup. If you haven't seen the previous episode, go click the card on screen now and check it out. And if you want to win one of the products featured in today's video, just drop a like and comment down below which one. I'll announce a winner on my Twitter at MSTechYT in a couple of days. This is the Corsair MM800. It's a brand new RGB mouse pad. You may be thinking, a what? An RGB mouse pad? Yes, RGB lighting is spreading like wildfire, and now for $60, you can get this MM800 with a 15 zone RGB border, nice soft materials, and a USB pass through for your mouse. The next is actually a peripheral. This is a gaming keypad, and basically for $33, you're getting a replacement for a gaming keyboard. So if you're like me, I like to type on scissor switches, so I have that scissor switch keyboard right there, but when I'm gaming, I can just pull out this gamepad. I definitely found it to be more ergonomic than a keyboard, and it's loaded with programmable buttons all around to really customize your experience. Next up is not a product, it's actually a hack, and it's the infamous hole in the desk to hide your keyboard wire so it looks like it's wireless trick. If you have a relatively inexpensive desk and want to get rid of your keyboard wire, you can actually just drill a hole right behind your keyboard and route the cable through that. Of course, this is a permanent modification, but it definitely makes it look really clean. Next up is a headphone stand. This one from Satechi is $35, but it's definitely worth the price. Not only is it made out of a really solid aluminum, but it's also packed with features. I'm talking a headphone jack that serves as a pass-through to your PC, a USB hub along the front, and a cable management rack in the back. It looks great, performs great, and doesn't cost too much. And the last product for today's setup hacks is a USB hub. Now this one is from Anir and it comes in at $18, but really most of these accomplish the same goal. It takes power from the wall and outputs it to six USB ports, providing a 2.4 amp current to every port. This is a must have if you frequently charge multiple devices at the same time. So that's it for episode three of five setup hacks. It seems like you guys are loving the series and it's great to see that we really enjoy making it. Uh, remember, if you want to win one of the products, just drop a like and leave a comment which one you want to win and I'll announce the winner on my Twitter in a couple of days randomly. Thank you for watching, subscribe to see more content and as always, stay classy.